Hello everyone, Trueblade basically welcome back to more Final Fantasy V for Job Fiesta. Last time we made our way, we, we got the, we got we upgraded our airship so we could go up to the rock of ruins that are high way up high though. With the, with the ruins that we saw before though. But before we go in that direction though, I'm gonna do a little bit of stocking up though a bit though, cause I because I'm a bit low on some items than I want than I thought it was though. And we uh, and I so, so we're actually heading out back over to Licks for a bit, though, because the, they got items. They got, the items that they got over there, particularly the items I'm looking for, are, are cheaper than normal. First of all, over there, though, again, like everything's on sale. So again, like literally everything's like half price from this, though. So, like, so first of all, not so much, not so much necessary right now. I'm gonna go ahead and get some more. I'm gonna go ahead and get some more gold needles right now, though. This is more long term, though. I'm gonna grab myself a few more tents while I'm here, though. But the big thing, though, is I want to stock. I want to get a few more ethers there because I'm gonna be using a good bit of magic here. So for this, for this upcoming area, though, so that magic is gonna help out a good bit for what I'm doing with this, though. So that's again, I want to stock up on that, though, because again, with the mid-level spells, I'm gonna be using going through MP quite a bit, though. After that quick little, after that quick little diversion, though, now we're gonna head back over to those, to, to those floating ruins there. The... Got a storeroom. Okay, I was, I was gonna see if it's actually said it on there, though. I think I actually already said what it was, though. Ronka ruins. Good bit of new enemies that we're gonna be running into here, though. And and some of the stuff over here that. So there's a good bit of stuff here that actually does take a good bit of damage from thunder, so I'm so I'm still gonna go have have those items equipped though, like those like the, like those stone heads right there, pretty much all taken out from from a thunder attack as well. Yeah, those raw mages though are gonna be using more mostly mid mid level spells like fire up Lazara, but otherwise they're not too much of an issue though, and everyone's gaining levels from that experience. So I was, I was actually a little I was actually pretty close to. To leveling up, like not too long ago, there, but but yeah, it's, it looks like there's gaps around over here, though. But, but you have to go through some of these passages over here. Though. I think if you go through this area as a thief, you you can actually see them, though. But also another new enemy, though, and a, and a critical one if you're if you're using a if you're using blue mages as well, enchanted fans. These things have a really good have a really good blue magic spell called White Wind, which is a really good blue ma magic healing spell. Also, that also they have they have a spell called they, they also have era as well, which means they, they, they you can get them for good wind for good wind magic as well. For the record, though, if you have those spells, if you have if you have the wind spells, don't even think about using them on them. Though they will just absorb it. But in any case, though, get to go up over here. They'll get themselves golden armor here. I think Bar I think Bart's can equip that because he's. Let's see here, gold armor though. It would boost his defense a good bit though, but lower his sp speed and equip and increase equip weight though. So it would lower his speed a bit though, but it makes sense. Gold is heavy, but but in any case, I think the defense is gonna help out a good bit though. But again, you're gonna have to. This area kind of requires a bit of trial and error though, because again, you're gonna have to. You kind of have to figure out where, where the paths are. I, again, I, I I may have to correct myself in this later though but I believe thief can see those passages though he can't basically like, spot the invisible pattern invisible path though but so again having a thief here would actually be if I remember correctly actually would help out a good deal and I was hoping to do some more before then though but actually that didn't do as much as I thought it would actually those wasn't, wasn't too bad though, but over this way here, because Chest is wait, waiting for us up over there though, and seriously, more of these red fans. Uh, more of these enchanted fans. I, red fans? Where did I read that from though? I was, I was probably thinking because I was going for red magic and, and then trying to read the fan thing at the same time there. <laughs> way to go, me! And I'm starting to wish I had cured instead of. That they'll be like, that, that's, a bit, that's a big reason I was saying about it, make, having a stock up on MP though, because I'm going to be doing a lot of healing while I'm here. In fact, actually, Ferris, you go ahead and you go ahead and heal up some of our heal up the party real fast. And Lena, you can go for the Thundara. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's the thing that can happen as well is that is that it can be they can single target as well, which does of course does a lot more damage. Got a dark bow from that, which I think I think that's a bow that inflicts that inflicts the darkness status, or or as I've called it before, blind. Let's see here, where is that? Where are you? The dark bow sometimes sometimes blinds enemies, though. Must be used two hand and full power from back row, though. None of our classes can equip that, though. So that that that's pretty much. That, that's gonna be useful if you have range though. Got an elixir over there though, so I really want to make sure I got that though. Elixirs are always really good to have. But yeah, otherwise, but yeah, we got more of these ruins over here though that we saw before. This area here with the, with the very clearly advanced civilization that this was though to have all this though. And uh, new enemy, Rocket Knights. I don't think there's anything too special about these guys if I'm remembering cor correctly though. But yeah, apparently there's some sense of there's like a little bit of semblance of like the of the warriors of this of this tribe though so unfortunately they don't seem to know what's happening though because they seem to think we're the bad guys at least in their mind I would think so and wow I am what how are they dodging my attacks like, like that though that's not normal there I'm trying to see if I can hurry before before then take take before that enchanted fan starts healing with white wind though I, 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 although the, the downside is that you would have to find a way to inflict confuse on on, on them the, uh, in order to get them to use that attack, though, and, and for you to be able to, to take it as a blue magic spell. Hopefully that'll take out. Okay, the, okay, so they're all down. So now it's just it's just the fan left, and it should be smooth sailing from there. Okay, no, never mind. He's already down. Three eight, three job points though, so that's that's a really nice one to. That's actually a really good formation to get, though. I'm heading over this way first, though, because there's actually a treasure chest that I can get to from this direction here. And to, and two more you guys. Okay. But okay, your hint as far as which one's the right path, though, is that, that gap on the other side over there. The gap in the plant... What looks like the plant life there. Golden shield over there, though. I could equip that to Bart's, though, but I would lose the benefits of the two-handed... Of the two-handed ability there that I've got on him right now, though, but it would it would help him dodge attacks, though. All right, then. So, but, but now we've gotten that though. It's like, like so we've got some golden some golden armor sets over here, though. Like the now we got the golden shield just now there with the golden armor. Now we can go back over this direction over here, and uh, there I want to go up over there though, and seriously more you guys. Okay, but I was, what I was gonna say is I want to go up over here though because up over here is a save room. It's, it's basically a save room here, and I'm also gonna go ahead and use a tent while we're here because I, I, again because Ferris and Lena are already running low on MP. And over there though, and actually I want to point that out though. Notice Lena's MP did not fully recover. A, again, like the tents don't heal every don't, don't heal everything. It, it it does max out how much it does heal though. But interesting. But we got this is a little, we got ourselves a, little, a bit of a checkpoint over here, though, so we can kind of move on from here, though, as we start reaching some of these upper other levels of the of these ruins here, though. So we, as we go up, as we go up these go through these passages over here, though, and I want to say the left is a dead end. Yes, it is. That's a dead end there. So I'm gonna go ahead and go this way here, and I, and this actually is gonna get a bit interesting, though, because. You may see way off over there though. There's a there's several chests, treasure chests over there, and there's also one over here that I just about walked right past there, and got ourselves another new enemy over here. I don't I don't think this thing has a weakness though. That I'm gonna go ahead and just try a couple different spells on it though. But I don't think this thing has a weak. I don't know if this thing has a weakness or not though. I'm, that might have been because of the fire of the thunder rod rather than actual weakness though. I don't know about that though. But it's pretty straightforward enemy though. Got a high potion over there though. I want to start by going through that staircase over there and up. Actually, let's go ahead and try. Let's try a blizzard now. Let's see what that does. And how that does. That does. Never mind, they're weak to blizzard. That did the most damage. Even, even with the even with the, even, even more than the thunder rod boosted thun, thundara. I want to say you want to go this way here. To this staircase up here to get that get that though that tower right in front of me right there is a trap 
That center tile's a trap there, so but you, so go around that though to get Gill, Shuriken, Power Armlet. I believe that's an accessory that's gonna let's let's see here. Actually what okay, can any can any of my guys equip that then? Gallop actually could make some good use of that though. Let's, get, let's give it to Gallop. All right, got a moon ring blade. That's uh, I don't think anyone party can use that though. And got an ancient sword. That is a that is definitely a good one for Bart's though, especially because I don't want. I'm eventually gonna hit a point here. I don't want the electric things. Sword that sometimes ages enemies, so it inflicts the old status on it though, and it also it's also a stronger sword as well. But yeah, I get at least now get to show that that. That's how it was a trap there. And it would have spit us out right over here, which actually, no, I want to go down here for that. And, and so that, but, but we got that part though, though. Now I want to go on ahead in this direction here though. And, and another new enemy over here though. The Archeo Toads. I want to say they are weak to Blizzard as well. So let's go ahead and go for those. Let's go for those spells there. Actually, I'm, I'm not convinced they are weak. I did not want to do that. I'm dumb. I, I, I actually, I actually wanted the kick. Okay, so, th so they're down. Okay, let's let's also test another theory as well. Let's use this rod to see if. It, okay, okay. So, so they don't, okay. I was making sure. I didn't know if they were immune to thunder or not. They're not. So I know there is an enemy here, despite some of the enemies being weak to thunder. Though that there are some here that are that actually absorb thunder. So that's that's kind of what I'm watching for. Uh, that's what I get for not paying att full attention there. But yeah, you, you can fall down that tile there, there, and drop back down to the bottom floor there. So just gotta walk around it. S simple as, not as simple as that though. I mean, the the rooms do have a some some simpler ones there. I want to see how, so I can try to conserve my MP a bit. Though. I want to see how much a regular just a, just normal blizzards do. Since now that I know that these things are weak to ice. That actually didn't do it. That actually didn't do that much. But but, but between Gallif and between Gar Gallif and Bart's there, yeah that, yeah that should finish him. That off though, and gang another level from this though. And so that's that's gonna be quite that's that that's quite nice that we're gaining some levels from this though. And oh boy. Okay, you're gonna go for the thunder and for. For those stone, for those stone things though, the stone masks, and then and then you're gonna go for Blizzard to hopefully take that one out. And not quite. Gal should finish it off. But in any case, though, like I said, we get to see another little save room, save circle over there. Though, not gonna go for that. That's just right up those stairs right there. I'm not gonna go for that just yet, though. Trust me though, I will I will be going back to that though. Trust me on that. I wanna go into this this way right here because I wanna get those chests over there. Got another ether in a cottage there, so that's gonna help out a great deal though. But ne but I'm not gonna go on ahead to that. The other way is the way to move forward though, but now I want oh crud Guys there's a Hydra here though. This, this is the enemy I believe this is the one that's immune to thunder, so I wanna So I'm gonna go try some other spells out. Can I put you to sleep? Let's try it. Yes, it is. I, I, I was able to put it to sleep. So let's go ahead and try to whittle away on you a bit, though. Well, you can't, well, you can't do anything. Because I, th I, th I, cause I think the thing can actually take a good bit of abuse, actually, though. And that, that also inflicted old as well, but it, it killed it anyway. Decent, a bit of, decent amount of experience, though. I want to say there's a trick to those things as well. That... that I don't remember too too much of that though. But in any case, though, let's go up over here into the safe into the safe room, the, the, the safe circle right here. Let, let's go ahead and use another tent, and, and and hopefully fully heal everyone this time though. And then we're gonna save up though because, well, because again, I, I don't want to lose progress if, if in case I run into a problem here though. I'm trying to remember if there's any other any other enemies here though. Okay, looks like everyone is fully healed up now, so let's go on ahead. 
Let's go on ahead over there, though. At least now I know the hydras are actually can be put to sleep, so I can. That doesn't mean that doesn't necessarily mean it's gonna work every single time. But now we can go on ahead this way here, and another one of you guys. Okay. Well, that didn't stay asleep for long. I, I, want, I always want to get hit with the physical attacks. Actually, we'll get. Oh, that's right! I, I got thunder out to quit. Right? That's not gonna work. So, that's right, I forgot about that. I forgot I had Thunder Rods equipped. Really ought to see if there's anything else I could do with that, though. But in any case, that over there, though, opens up this way over here. And th there's King Tycoon. I'm going to go ahead and use a... Barks, you're going to go ahead and drink a potion there. Drink a few potions there. Yeah, gee, I wonder what I'm prepping for. Oh, the, ugh, that bedamned clapper claw blocks the path. Uh, silence. This is there's no time for chatter. That beast is the guardian of these ruins. It can change its weakness at will. Make yourself useful and defeat it. Boss time! And this one actually is a bit interesting here. This one... Like, like King Tycoon was saying, this thing can change its weakness at will. So, Libra, let's go ahead and get a read on it, though. Question mark about the HP, though. Vulnerable to win. Don't have that, unfortunately. So, we're gonna have to, so we're gonna have to do this the, the other way, though. It has Breath Wings, so let, let, we've seen this move quite a few times before. This thing has an interesting gimmick, and you want to kind of keep track of... Of roughly how much damage you do to this thing here, though. So that was like around like 700-ish. Since Thundara was doing pretty well with my with the boost, I'm going to go ahead and use that. And I want to say... One more... Okay, that's around that point there, though. But, but in any case, though, after around every 1,600 damage you do to it, it changes, it changes forms. It, there's no visual cue for that, though. But physical attacks will do, be doing more and more damage to it while it changes its weakness. So now it's got that's be it's gonna be using frost. Dang that hit hard! We're gonna be healing instead. We're gonna be healing instead. I was gonna attack, but that that hit pretty hard. And I think that also inflicted sap on my, on my party as well. Yes, it did. Okay, yeah, y'all are in healing du duty right now. And then, Bart, you go ahead and attack it, though. That should take it down to Form 3 now, which, where I think it, you want to start using... Where I think it starts going for... Let's see here. I'm going to see if I can get a read on this thing. Yeah, it, I think it's on Form 3 now. Again, question mark, question mark. And no, nothing about weakness, so... I want to say that... I want to say now it's going to start using fire stuff. Fire-based attacks, if I remember correctly. I don't remember the order of it, though. But in any case, though, I also gotta... Actually, I probably ought to start letting some of my guys start actually going down a bit, though, to get rid of that. Oh, actually, no, sap wore... Actually, no, sap wore off. Okay. Alright, y'all... At this point, though, we're starting... We're gonna start hitting the point, though, where the main thing you want to start doing now is just... Is, is, is healing, though. Let's see here. I want to say I haven't taken out this form yet. I'm pro I definitely by the time Bart attacks it though, and ow, that actually did a good amount of damage though. And oh, I don't have, I don't have, I I, I don't have chakra on him now. Okay. Let's see here. Uh, where's Bull? Uh, you go ahead and heal up the party, Ferris. I'm gonna have to see if I still got the eye drops for that though, so I can get rid, of, so I can get rid of that. Let's see here. Do I still have the like the? Do I? Oh, oh no, I don't. This this is bad. This is this is very very bad right now. Because Bart was gonna because Bart was my main damage dealer. Yeah, 
Yeah, this, this is bad. Do I seriously not have a... That heals Toad. Oh no, I, I I don't have anything to for, I don't have anything for that now. This is this is very bad. Please tell me that's gonna wear off at some point though. That's I would love for that to wear off at some point there. No, but it's, no, he's he's keep he's he's gonna keep missing here. Ah, uh, I'm actually wondering if I should let Barts go down, actually. Be be because if Barts goes down, that does remove the blink stat. That, 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 that does remove blind. Yeah, I'm thinking I might want to let Barts go down a bit, though, and then I'll just, and I'll just heal him up. It's because that, 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 will get, that, that will get rid of... that. Though, and now we're in final form! Ar Archaeoavis was revived. Oh! Look at it, such energy! This is the true power of the crystals! We're on a final form right now and Bart's up- you- you somehow hit! Th th this thing has some nasty attacks in this form. And magic is pretty much useless on it at, at this form though, so you're- So you may just focus on healing at this point there while you just wail on it with physical attacks though. Blue Mages, level 5 death works wonders against this thing, though, while well, it's in this form. And actually, I think, actually, not think about it, though, I think it does have the undead status. In fact, actually, so let's go ahead and try that now, because I think it is considered undead. No, it's, it still heals up! It still heals up, so that, that, that was, that was really bad then. Oh! You suck! You basically, you basically just cripple all my main dam ways of damaging you now. Because again, magic's useless. I'm gonna maelstrom. That reduces everyone. That, that's hit by it to single digits. That's that's bad. Bart, I must say, Bart, I need you to start hitting this thing, please. Because Galv, because Galv is currently paralyzed right now. Tusk and uh, that also hit that that also hit with confusion as well. Okay, yeah, th thank goodness that actually worked out there though. There we, we yeah, it's like even just a failed attack like that will allow you to cure someone of confusion though. And uh, I was about to say, did you just do it that? Seriously. Maelstrom, that was... Oh, no! And that actually took out Ferris, too. I think I just killed myself. No, I did not! Get off! You did it, get off! Oh, my gosh! Well, that sucks that Ferris is not going to see the benefit of the... Of the AB of the job points from this thing though. Well Bars gained a job low gained equip shields, that's basically gonna allow another job to equip shield there, but oh my gosh. Good work, very good. <laughs> yeah, that ain't suspicious at all. Earth crystal should ju be just ahead. Yeah. Right there. Um, uh, this is bad. Something's gotta be controlling him. You think? That was definitely not a good action there, though. And run up fast. Are you serious? Don't even try it. Are you? Did you not see what's happening to him? Seriously. With the four of you gathered like this, it would be easier to destroy you all. Have you figured it out, you two? Oh, uh, and uh, something's happening here. Uh, 
Uh, so we got another meteorite there going through there. There and uh, this happened. There and uh, it's you. That one we saw. That we were seeing in some of the flashbacks. Grandpa. Yep, it, it is indeed. It is indeed that girl. I'm so glad you're okay. And uh, he's still got a little bit of the am still drawing a bit of a blank there. And <laughs> I love how he knocks away the question mark <laughs> on there as he as he figures it out. And Gallus' memory return. Awesome, guys! He's got his memory back. Grandpa, I miss you so much. And so everyone's waking back up now there, and, uh... Father. <laughs> like, oh, don't worry, I just hit him with a little strike of thunder. He should be okay. So you just hit him with a- we just hit him with thunder. Just, just a weak- just a weak spell. Where- Lena, Sarissa, Sarissa, is that you? It really is you. I can't believe it. You're alive. So they do. So the family does reunite. Oh, I think I can finish that word. That that, that, that sentence for you, Bart. Oh crap! The Earth crystal shattered, and that was the last one. This is that is, of course, very very bad. We'll say though the music over here is cool. These though, wow, this very thing we were trying to, that that we learned about not too long ago, that we were trying to stop, has just happened. X death. Gallop, it is good to see you again. For it means I have returned. <laughs> it's X death in his blue armor. And he's got control of the crystals somehow. This, of course, is that's not good. Crystals, obey my magic. Give me your power. Smite these vermin. Death approaches. You think we're gonna just sit back and let you do whatever you want? And okay, yeah, Bart's just got the snap beat out of him there. <laughs> now the crystals have been destroyed. Next shall be your world, Galuf. And so, X Death has taken off there. And, uh. Tycoon's here. Lena, Sorsa, Lena, Bart, and you, warriors from another world. I fear your work is still unfinished. You must now allow the world to disappear into nothingness. And, uh, okay, what did that just do? It made things a little brighter there for a moment there. Light of Earth, come forth and reclaim your essence from me. So the crystals are... What's going on? Oh! He's letting... Well, that knocked all of them back, though. Oh, so... Yeah, but the crystal's still under excess control. Yeesh. Get back, the crystal must be saved. Well, saved as you can get it, considering it's already shattered and excess already in wreaking havoc. Well, whatever you did, it did something there. You can't die. Forgive me, I wasn't much of a father. Yeah, but say how I mean yep I mean you have Windrix, you could have looked for her. Stay together, become each other's strength. Barts, take care of them as I cannot. You really trust this to Barts? You can't don't don't leave us. And
it was too late. And the crystals are lighting up as well, so that means it's... That means it's also more jobs time, so we've got the got the earth crystal, the last crystal, so that we, we got access to to four more jobs, if those crystals are any indication. Resting within the sh shard, a warrior spirit. Samurai. Dragoon. Dancer. Chemist. And, uh, oh boy. What's going on? The ruins, they're falling. Yeah, given that the earth crystal... But the Earth Crystal was letting it was letting it lift, so let us seriously. Come on. And so now it's time for not quite an escape sequence because this is all cutscene here. So, but yeah, again, without the Earth, without the Earth Crystal to power it, it's the ruins are falling back down. And by the way, that treasure chest will always show unopened, though, whether you opened it or not in in the game, like when you actually were going through. But in any case, though, it's time to get out of Dodge. Whole fest, this will be a bumpy ride. And so the ruins are, are back to the ground. And it looks like they're... Did it just... I think it just... just just blew up as well, just destroyed it, crashed and destroyed itself. Lena. Father. He's gone, isn't he? You kind of just watched him die. And the Gallif, whoa! Something wrong? Yeah, we've got to get moving. And now! Huh? What's going on? Bars, did you just not see that warlock show up? The one who basically beat the snot out of you with those crystals? It's all come back to me. I remember everything. X-Death is an evil warlock from my world. Thirty years ago, he came here to destroy this world's crystals. I and three others, the Dawn Warriors, sealed him with the power of the crystals. Everything was fine for thirty years. We thought it was all over. Yeah, that didn't work out too well. But something bad was happening to the crystals. Once we figured it out, we took the meteors and came back here. But I was too late. Exodus has not only been freed, but has returned to our world. So yeah, the, he still ended up succeeding in destroying the crystals. The machines as well. That's because we used too much of the crystals' power, right? Partly so. It was also the fact... It, Exodus was also manipulating stuff as well to ensure that would happen too. We were the ones who left X death on this world in the first place. Back then we should have dragged him back to our world, like he said. So... Yeah, that... This has gone really bad. So you guys are really going back. Yeah, we've got a CLX death again. Kral's meteorite should sure still have some juice left. Probably enough, only enough for one more trip, though. Bart, Lena, Ferris, thank you so much for everything. I'll miss you guys. Uh, Gallif? What kind of nonsense is that? We're going with you. You must say, yeah, the four, the, we're the four light warriors. No, you're not. This is the last meteorite. That means if you went to my world, you'd never be able to come back here. Farewell. And she's saying her goodbye as, as well. So we... They really are going back. And this always really was a little confusing though, because at first it would seem like that the media was going to fly up to them, but it looks like they're just the media is just transporting them back to their world. But in any case, though, yeah, all we have left is the meteorite that's over here, though. The ruins are gone. And now, it, normally that would have been a point where I would cliffhang the video there. It just, just ended it right then and there. But 
There's a couple reasons I didn't do that, because the moment you try to land the airship to even save the game, to even save the game, it triggers another cutscene. Parts. Yeah. So we've been talking for the whopping three, for the whopping five seconds we were up flying around in the airship. They're still fighting excess in, in that other world, and we we gotta avenge Papa. What's more, Gallop, he's Well, yeah, Bart's was yeah, Bart's was all set for this in the first place. He's one of us. We knew you'd get it. I mean, like Bart's was all for this in the first place, so he's like, think, no, we're coming with you. Let's go then to the other world. But how do we do that? Meteorites don't have enough power to warp anywhere. Yeah, that's kind of a... Well, when I think meteorites, I think Sid. He'll probably know something. He hasn't let us down yet. But in any case, though, now that we've got this, though... And, and, and the other reason that I wanted to, to wait on this as well is, is... Is also that, at least for the Earth Crystal, like for this one last crystal, I wanted to... Instead of doing this off-screen, I wanted to actually go ahead for this, though, and actually tweet it, so that way I can actually... That way I'll be able to go ahead and just actually tweet on, on the camera, though, and actually show the job right now before I go before I call this video right here, though. Like, I want to do is, like, for, for at least one crystal, though, and sometimes it takes a little bit for, for him to come back to it, though, but in any case, I'm tweeting Earth to, to Gilgabot now. Which means it's time for me, for me to get my last job. So, and sometimes it takes a little bit for the Gilgobot to come back. But though, so if it takes too long, I might cut ahead to that though. But 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 we'll see it. But, 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 but we'll see it in a little bit though. Ha ha ha! I'm screwed. <laughs> Well, I ain't dying, at least! My last job! My last... My last job that I got! Like I said, I ain't, I ain't gonna be dying, at least! At least not... At least not that easily. Where is it? Where? Oh, there you are. White Mage. That's right. White Mage is my last job. Ha 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 ha. Well, I'm pretty much... I'm pretty much screwed against the super bosses, I think. Oh, actually... Um, actually, there's a chance that maybe not, though, because I mean, I get access to some, some really good white magic, though. It also gives me access to Asuna that I've been kind of sitting on, though. Well, the, like I said, so I think I can make this work, though. And besides, I get access to a good white magic spell, some good white magic stuff later, though. So, white mage is my last job there. So, with that knowledge, though, we're gonna end off this video here. So next time on Final Fantasy V for Job Fiesta, we're gonna we're, we're gonna figure out we're gonna go find Sid and try to figure out how we're supposed to get to Gallus World. See you guys then. Thank you all for watching.